Well, I've had police say two armed robberies took place right across the street from one another this weekend. One at the St. Boniface Church and the other at O'Rear's Bakery. News 18's Kiera Lake joins us live from North 9th Street. North 9th Street. Hi there, Kiera. Sunday around 8.45 a.m., police responded to an armed robbery at O'Rear's or Rear's Bakery. I spoke with Greg Littner and he says his wife Judy Littner is in bad shape after being robbed at gunpoint. Greg Littner says his wife was working alone at O'Rear's Bakery when she was robbed at gunpoint. Money was one thing, but when you lose your whole Sunday business, it just really hurts a lot. He says he arrived at the bakery 20 minutes later and saw four officers around the building. And they were talking to her and I went and held her and she was shaking so bad, I feel like I'm still vibrating because she was that upset and that emotional. Littner says the man walked into the bakery wearing a sweatshirt and sunglasses. He ordered cream horns and a Florentine. Went and he made him a couple fresh cream horns, uh, put a Florentine in a box for him, turned to go to the register, and when she turned around, he came around the corner and pointed her gun in the face. He says his wife told the man robbing the bakery was not worth it. And he said, it's worth the money to me. Almost 12 hours later, police were called right across the street to St. Boniface Church. A 61-year-old parishioner says she left the church and went to her car where she was robbed at gunpoint. You heard of kind of like anything happening like this? Not at all. Nope, nope. I didn't, it's just the first time I heard this. Juan Chavez has been going to St. Boniface Church for 23 years. No violence, no nothing. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what to tell you. This is kind of scary, like I say. The man stole the woman's purse and left. Police say it is possible the two robberies are connected and patrols in downtown will be increased. And everybody has been safe and this is, like I said, this is the first thing that's really happened to us in what, 11 years? Littner says he hopes his customers come back and this does not hurt business. Police say no one was hurt in either armed robbery. Reporting live in Lafayette, Kiera Lake, News 18.